Hello everyone, before the video starts, I just wanted to let you guys know that I just started my brand new Discord server. I thought it would be easier to, to respond to all your questions on Discord instead of in the, in the YouTube comments. So, so join my Discord server if you have any questions or if you want any help with your map or any, or anything. If, uh, if, if you have anything that's bugging you, I might be able to help, hopefully. Apart from that, you might be the first one to join because the only people in the server are two bots and me. So you might be the first person to join. So yeah, see you there. Hello everybody and welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to set up World War II ACS guns. So if you didn't know, again, this is like the third time I'm explaining this on this channel. Um, ACS is a first person gun system and it's pretty good, I'm not going to lie. I made comparisons about it, uh, made tutorials how to set it up. But this tutorial is about how to set up World War II ones because I've been receiving many comments about, about how to set up World War II guns especially. So I guess why not make a tutorial so that everyone can see it in one place. So, so let's get right into it right now. So let's. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is type in S-P-Y-D-E-R-I-E. -E. There you go. Search, then you'll see all his guns come up right here. So, this is the German one, the Russian one, American one, British one, and the which I'm pretty surprised about because we barely even see French guns in on Roblox. So, that's pretty cool too. For this video, we're just gonna add the German pack, but I guarantee you that every single one of them works perfectly fine. So here are the guns. Once you click, once you click them, the guns will appear physically on the map, so you can see them as ammo boxes and even grenades. So let's begin. So the first thing that you're gonna want to do is go open this folder, Spies World War II ACS German under Workspace. So then what you're gonna want to do is open ACS, just any ACS, just like that. Then you're going to want to click on the first one, ACS official release. There we go. Then open up the folder, it will appear under workspace, then open up the folder. And then you put this, you open ACS AI, put it in hard play to storage. Tools, you put in starter pack. And you can delete that because we don't need it anymore. Then the footsteps. Take this, put it in sound service. This will basically make a more realistic effect in your game. Because, because you can hear the footsteps. Like, you can hear the footsteps louder and clearer. And it's just way cooler than the than what and the footsteps that Roblox has to offer. This in server script service. <clears throat> this you can put in workspace. This and starter starter character scripts. And the tools you can delete because we're not using um, modern day tools, we're using World War II tools right now. Server ship, script, ser server script service again. And replicated storage, and then you're all set. But the only thing that you have to do is instead of going here to tools and pasting all these tools in the starter pack, if you do that, then it won't work. Because as you see, there are two different folders here, client and server. Now the first time I saw these, I was like, what the heck is this? Didn't understand it, but then I guess I learned. And this is what, what you have to do with them. You go to a ACS engine, pop that up, and you go to the first gun models right here. Not the second. And you go to gun models, not gun mods, and you might get confused with that. Be careful to not get confused with gun mods and gun models. So you go to gun models, open it, and as you see, there's this. 
to client. And it has all the guns that we deleted. So I guess we can delete these because we don't have the tools. So it's kind of useless to have them here. Also, just so you guys know, it's unnecessary to delete them, but it's also unnecessary to have them in. So to make it easier and not to make it easier and understandable, let's just say let's just delete them for now. Okay, so client is done, so you can delete it. Server, copy all the guns that are all the models that are in server, and you paste it in server, just like that. Then you close it, and then you're basically done. There's one thing still missing, which is turning, which is turning your character to R6. So what you're gonna want to do is go to game settings, publish the game, call it test. Just wait for it to. Sometimes it takes a while to load. Avatar. You go click on settings again. You go to avatar, and you click on R6, and then you're basically done then you can test the game out one last thing don't forget to take the tools from this and put it in starter pack there we go and here we go we have all the guns in our inventory and as you see it works perfectly so it's pretty amazing Guns are pretty smooth. Now let's check the damage that they do to other players. So let's just get a AI gunner and shoot him. There we go. So yeah, that's basically it. Um, also, the one really cool thing is that you can turn these guns into ACS R15, which just looks absolutely amazing. You can check that out in one of my other videos. So yeah, go check that out. And, uh, and thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys have any issues or problems, then and you can leave a comment below if you have any suggestions for what you want to see in the next video if you have anything specific that you want to see could put it in the comments please i beg you guys um subscribe if it was helpful leave a like i guess and uh i'll see you guys in the next video